Golf in Marrakesh offers a captivating blend of sport and culture set against the stunning backdrop of the Atlas Mountains. The vibrant city in Morocco has become a premier golfing destination, attracting enthusiasts from all around the world. Myself and Ali visit a selection of popular golf courses to play whilst visiting Marrakesh, starting with Al Madan. Right, so we're here on the 12th signature hole at Al Madan absolutely stunning hole so my thoughts so far on the course after playing a couple of holes you know it, it really does feel like a Carl Phillips course lots of bunkers lots of sort of wavy fairways but course is in great nick greens are rolling brilliantly absolutely loving it so unlike a lot of the courses that Carl Phillips designed this one specifically was never actually designed to become a championship venue, but actually this gem was created to be enjoyed by golf lovers years to come. And just like that, we're at another fantastic golf course here in Marrakesh, the Noria Golf Club. I mean, what's your first, first thoughts on it from up here? Wow, you've got a square green, you've got two square greens, and then it's split by a stream of water. You know, that is very unique, very unique. One thing that I did notice is, you know, it was a 20 minute car ride from Al Madan to here. We drove past the um, Jal Riyadh, we drove past Royal Marrakesh. So you can definitely like have a golf holiday here and not have to travel too far, which is obviously a massive plus for us. Designed by renowned architect, Steve Forrest, Noria Golf Club presents a challenging yet enjoyable 18 hole layout. The course features undulating fairways, strategically placed bunkers and pristine greens, providing a fair test for golfers of all skill levels. Here we are at the Noria Golf Club. Now look at this. I think we've got a nice angle for you there, just to see. Very unique, it's very pleasing on the eye though. It is, but I'm yeah. gonna give it to him. Yeah. This is, <laughs> oh, I'm, gonna give it, I'm gonna say something big here, Alan. Okay, okay here with we go. Me. I'm, on, I'm gonna on, say, come I think this might be one of my favorite par threes that I've ever seen. Here we go. Noria, taking I, I, the gold medal. I honestly think, I mean, just look at it. It's so pleasing to the eye. It's very symmetrical. We've got that lovely square building, square water feature, square green. We've got some lovely trees either side. It's very OCD. <laughs> it's, it's very nice, yeah. isn't it? It's, very, just, uh, it's a golf hole. I almost want to take a picture and put it on my living room wall and just look at it. So nice. It's so nice. And it is a two tier green at the back there. So if you hit it long, it's going to come back towards you. It's a very friendly, friendly hole, this one, apart from the water. <laughs> That's not in my mind, that's fine. <laughs> so in terms of Noria Golf Club, yeah. what do you think about it so far? I mean, it's quite quirky. It's got, Good you know, words. it's got, yeah, it's very Good quirky. Words. It's got loads of these little things, like especially with this, like the square greens, we've seen like 18 and hole nine have that as well. I think it's just very like a unique golf course, which it makes it. It is. Like our uh, hole four driving to the green, you go through this big like structure building yeah, it and nice. I think it's just got these little things about it. It is quirky, yeah. I like that. I think that sum summarises it very well yeah. actually. And in 10 years, I think once these trees and stuff grow and you know, they're metres tall, I think it's going to be really, really good. And I think it's certainly, I mean, at the minute, it definitely is a course to play. And I think it's going to be one of those courses that just get better and better and better as the years go on, right? Welcome to Royal Golf Marrakesh. This is one of Marrakesh's most celebrated golf courses. It's situated so close to the city centre. It's located close to Asifid. It's located near hotels and it's only 15 minutes away from the city centre. So I can imagine this golf course being the perfect course to play for somebody that wants to venture into the city for a bit of fun, someone that can escape the city to relax, but it's also giving you the option to experience Marrakesh at its finest. We are now on the signature ninth hole. Oh, look at that, thing of beauty. Now that is quirky. That's a masterpiece. I actually think that's a masterpiece. Some, people, some people may not like it and be like, that's not my cup of tea, but I love that, that I has like character. It. I like it, it's a bit crazy. Yeah. What have you thought so far of the course that we've played? You know what? I've absolutely loved it. Like the tree-lined fairways, 
It's beautiful. It's actually quite nice because it's quite hot. There's a bit of shade on the golf course. Greens are in absolutely unbelievable condition. Like for this time of year, they are quick, firm and quick. Bunkers, white sand, delicious. I love it. Yeah, I think it's going to be one of my favourite courses here in Marrakesh. And there are some courses that we've played and um, I've almost wanted to see that course in like a few years time, 10 years time, because we want to see it mature. This course has been here since 1929. It really does have that nice course maturity. And I think it's paying off a lot with the aesthetics of the course. It just looks fantastic. And like you were saying, it's low season, the conditions are great. Welcome to the Fairmont Royal Palm, Marrakesh. Welcome to the clubhouse. Designed in 2017, this is a great place to chill and relax after a round of golf. You've even got the golf on in the background and also lots of golf memorabilia around here. Designed by Campbell B. Robinson, the man which is responsible for many of Europe's best layouts. And that is exactly why people have ranked this one of Morocco's top courses. Views, this is views. The Atlas Mountains. That's, That's what we wanted. That is, that is what we wanted, <laughs> yeah. So I think right now, so usually in around the high season, you would actually see the Atlas Mountains being nice and snow-capped, which I think would look incredible. But um, yeah, the temperatures here in Morocco right now, a bit too high for that but it does look incredible with it when it's oh. snow capped doesn't it but it still takes nothing away from that view right now it looks fantastic so Campbell B Robinson designed this lovely course that we are playing right now and Campbell B Robinson he has designed a lot of Europe's favorite courses and now he is absolutely smashed one out in Morocco here at the Royal Palm Marrakesh what's your thoughts on the few holes we've played lovely there's a lot of bunkers as well big big bunkers big old are, bunkers I, I love how they're like crafted usually like about bunkers like a circular one but these are like yeah they so are there's a nice little I don't yeah. know if there's a nice little vibe to that it's like your I word like that you used quirky nice, yeah. nice quirky I like that. bunkers we like that don't we we do like that we do like that I mean they really are taking care of this course even in the low season so I can only imagine what it looks like in the high season but I'm so excited to get around this course and shoot hopefully a good score at the Royal Palm Marrakesh another fantastic golf course in Morocco is Samana. Beautiful. <laughs> it's a little heart shape for it. Oh, I, I love know. it, man. I love it. It's picturesque. This looks like it's on like a, you, know, you could just frame this. You could. You really could. I mean, that's like a signature view, isn't it? Yeah. Like when you go on the Your Golf Travel um, website, you can just see this picture. And they, this is the view that we remembered. We drove up to it and we were like, seen that view, seen that view before. And it did not disappoint at all. It's fantastic. Ali, you were saying that the condition in here in the low season is good. Yeah, like tea boxes, like complete lush grass, unbelievable. There's like no divots. It's, where, are the, where are the divots? I can't see even see any. There are, yeah. There's about to be two. Well, yeah, obviously. <laughs> but then obviously the fairways, incredible condition, and also the greens, really, really good for this time of year, which is amazing considering the climate that Morocco's in. It's... It must be watering it. And another fact about this course is it's the only course in Morocco to hold the PGA Championship. I wasn't thinking there, I was letting you think, so then you could come back and be like, I know the answer to that. So if you got it, well done. Um, but yeah, that, what a great thing to have, to be able to say you're the only course yeah. in Morocco. You know, I think that says a lot. I think it says that it brings a certain level of standard. I think you can expect a challenging game, but the amount of tees that are offered here means that a higher handicapper can enjoy the course as well, which makes it a great course to play on your holiday to Morocco. So we are here at Asifid Golf Course in Marrakesh. And it is a delight, to be fair. We have played a few holes now and it is incredible, right? Oh yeah. How are you playing so far? I'm playing good, I'm, in, I'm enjoying the course. So it's lovely, you know, got the blue skies, warm weather. I know. It, what more could you want? The, the Atlas Mountains, up there, they're coming out. You can, you can see pretty much the Atlas Mountains from everywhere you are if the, uh, the sky is clear. And it's getting there, it's early morning still. So hopefully in this video, we can get some shots where you can really see those Atlas Mountains. The course was designed by former European Tour Pro, Niall Cameron. Did you know that? I did not know right, that. There you but go. he's done a great job. He has done a great job with this. He, ha he, has, <laughs> he has done a great job. I think it's, it's, it's mature. I think the course, you can tell it's been here for a little while. But all the surroundings are really, really nice. And it's kept so well. Considering we are playing this in the low season, the course conditions are fantastic. I would love to see them, you know, 
between like November and April because that bet yeah, day look pure. Mate, the greens will be rapid. Like at the moment, the greens are still running really well, but they're a bit fluffy because obviously you've got the hot conditions. They're looking after the greens for that winter season. It's, it's going to be so, so oh, good. So, and this is, like I say, November to April, that is winter golf. So if you're based in the UK and you want some sun and you want to play some golf, it's going to be perfect here. I think they say it floats around 25 to 30 degrees between that time. So you can really enjoy your game of golf here at Asenfid Golf Course. As the reach of low cost European airlines extend further south, places like Morocco become much more viable and economical for traveling golfers. Flight access is good, there are great all-inclusive options and the golf courses here are superb. So if this sounds like the perfect golf holiday for you, make sure you book your Moroccan golf break with your golf travel.